Well, hello. I'm Michael Carbonaro. Thank you for thank you for being here at the After Effect, where we talk about tonight's episode of the Carbonaro Effect. Um, thanks for checking it out. Thanks for writing these questions in. I'm going to try and answer them to the best of my ability. Thank you for gathering them for me. Edward writes in saying, "Which part of the performance is your favorite? Setup, reaction, or reveal?" Um, it's the reaction, and, and in that reaction is the belief. It's when they believe it, that's my favorite part of it. When you see that little glimmer of belief or watch them turn all the way up. from not yeah. believing to believing, that's my favorite. How was there that much oh, in that's there a lot. I wasn't hearing it? Thanks for that question, it was cool. Amanda asks, what would you do differently to make the Russian space case more believable? Yeah. It's like a human body. Huh? It's like a body. Oh, it's like a suit. Yeah. Whoa. This has got to be. Uh, is this freaking the new guy out, right? Dude, hello? <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> I almost had him, you know, and that's why I wanted to show that trick because it was such a cool concept. Sometimes I don't know what someone will believe, what they won't believe. But what would have made the Russian space case more believable? Maybe if it wasn't an inflatable thing, maybe if it was like pieces that I had to click together, and once it clicked together, someone came out, maybe that'd be more believable. Are you kidding me? Is this like, am I being punked right now? I don't know why it didn't work. Stop pestering me. Um, but you'd like seeing that, right? It's kind of fun to watch when I fail. We all like it. Um, Taylor says, do you laugh every time you squeeze oranges now? Oh my gosh. That is, is that true. fast or what? It sure is. Just right out. And you did a whole glass You could glass just get yeah, a whole glass full of that right there. You know, I never laugh on the show, and I, I did laugh then. It's just too funny. She was covered. It, it, it makes me laugh because it's so easy. Lauren, have you ever liked a disguise so much that you've considered making it your everyday look? Uh, definitely, the Best Buy look. The best part about it is that everything here, the whole store, it's touch screen now. Each and every... Who doesn't want to look like that all day long? Come on. Uh, Jim says, and this is the last question here, what were some of the other titles you considered for the show? That is a good one. Um, oh man, in retrospect, they all seem so bad, right? I remember we were gonna call it uh, Trickster. I remember I liked that name, Trickster. There was, uh, what other names were it? There was like Tricky Business was thrown out there or Impractical Magic was actually the first thing because it was True TV and they loved the Jokers and Carbonaro Effect is what stuck and it's so, such a cool title. It, it ended up just discovering itself through the title and what the show was, what the show was. And it is the Carbonaro Effect. And with that, thank you guys so much for writing in. You can write more questions to hashtag AskMichaelCarbonaro. You can do that on Twitter. Go to the Facebook page, write to the Carbonaro Effect Facebook page, write to my Facebook page, write to your friend's Facebook page, write to Mark Zuckerberg yourself, and uh, let him know you love the show. Thank you guys, and we'll see you next time.